hero, hero, hero. It's Clown Man. I'm just chilling here in my bedroom, and at this point, I think I'm I'm trying the uh, the YouTube record video thing. See how well it turns out. I'm not sure if it's going to be any different or not. This is mostly just a pre-rant and probably some additional details. Uh, so the the rant this is going to be for is for Max Payne 3 for the PS3, and a lot of people. A, like, even I've heard a lot of people are just giving this game ridiculous amounts of shit. Like, they go, oh, it's so bad, it's horrible, and all this stuff. And it's got a really bad rap. You know, every time, when I went to buy it, it's like, why are you buying this? Like, because I want to try it, I've wanted to play it for a while. It's like, oh, it sucks. I'm like, we'll see. So, I picked up the game for 20 bucks. Um, I'm pretty pleased with that. I got three games for 60 bucks. Awesome, I was so pleased with myself. But anyways, that's not important. What's important is the pre-rant and then any additional details I can think of afterwards. Um, so yeah, I picked up Max Payne 3 for the PS3, started playing it. I'm not very far. I'm at chapter 4. I don't know how many chapters. Are. Hold on, I'll Google how many chapters are in Max Payne. Max Payne 3. Enter. Um, chapters. Oops. Enter. Here we go. This might answer my question. Come on, work, you stupid internet. Okay, so there's 14 chapters, and I'm on chapter 4. So basically, um, I'm a eh, good 20% through the game. Or 25, eh, about, yeah, 24, 23.5% through the game. So far, I'm really enjoying it. It's relatively short in comparison because I I probably only been playing it for a total of like maybe six hours no less than that maybe like four max like an hour per chapter kind of thing uh, but I'm also not you know going after all the pickups and I'm also playing on I think medium difficulty yeah medium difficulty but yeah it's so far it's pretty fun I'm enjoying it uh, you know, everyone's giving it a bad rap for, I would assume, a really bad, for no reason almost, because I am enjoying the hell out of it. You know, there's, I haven't been getting all the collectibles, I'm mostly, mostly focusing on playing the game. But yeah, I'm very much enjoying it. The timeline is some fuck, though, even I can tell. So it starts out, like, here, then it goes to, like, here, or here. And then down, probably down back to here, like over in this general area, and then it'll come back up to here to finish the story. Because you start, you start at one point, then you go into uh, like a set of memories of you know a bunch of missions. Then at the end of that, you go into more memories. So it's a lot of flashbacks and stuff, which fucks the timeline over something fierce, kind of like Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. Uh, but yeah, I'm very much enjoying the game. And who texted me? Got a text message from a cutie pie. She cut her finger open when she got in a car accident. Anyways, um, <clears throat> so yeah, it's the timeline is really fucked, but so far gameplay wise is very very fun. I die a lot. Like it's not a hard game, but it's it's easy to die, which is a little frustrating. But you know that comes with the territory of the game. It's yeah, but yeah, I've so far I'm very much enjoying it. If I were to rate it based on what I've played so far, I'd give it a solid seven. Seventy out of a hundred, seven hundred out of ten, that or out of a thousand, you know, it's a decent game. I'm enjoying it. Um, ordered some stuff from the Boondock Saints website and Victory Merch. So happy, gonna get a Jungle Rot like uh. Uh, Terror Regime bonus pack comes with a shirt, the CD, and a poster for 20 bucks. I was like, fuck yeah! And then, uh, I bought a t-shirt from Boondock Saints. I don't fucking remember which one I bought. Fuck. Uh, actually, I might be able to find it. Boondock Store. 
All right. I want all products. Men's apparel, t-shirts. Uh, what the fuck one did I get? I think I are I are the I either got the uh Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got the uh word like a 7-Eleven. We're not always open, but we're not always doing business, but we're always open. Uh, as for the band, uh, so far everything's at a bit of a standstill or a hiatus, if you will. I'm trying to find a new place to live so we can jam. So far, it isn't going very well, but you know, staying hopeful. Um, there might be some member changes up, change ups in the future. I don't know. It depends what's the word going on. <clears throat> Here's the way I see it. Uh, the one we have five people. Five. Uh, five people hooked up, not hooked up, uh, saying that they would play. Well, four technically. The other guy I haven't talked to at all, ever. Because there's me and Tula and Nick. Me and Tula are for sure. <clears throat> That's a definitely, 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 definitely. There's Nick, and he might be moving to Lethbridge with Faggot, I mean Connor. And there's Ken, that I, he, I haven't talked to him in months. And then his brother Kevin, and I've never talked to him, so I don't know if they're still down, if they're not, what the fuck's going on. At some point, I'm gonna have to do some kind of like a interviewy thing or whatever, to figure out you know if you want to be in the band, kind of shit. But yeah, that's about it. I mean, it's blowing my mind that I've been on the camera for seven minutes now, but whatever. Um. Uh, rants looking, uh, I'll probably end up doing a Far Cry 3 rant at some point, or a review, sorry. Actually, I think I'm going to do that now, <laughs> after this. Um, yeah, I've, yeah, but back to Max Payne 3, very, so far, very fun game. I enjoy it. But for most of, if you guys wanted to try it, I'd say rent it. Don't buy it. Because if you buy it, it'll, you'll probably beat it very quickly and then be mad. Like, oh, I just wasted 20 bucks. Just rent it. You'll probably beat it in a week kind of thing. But yeah, that's about it. For about a minute and a half, this is Cloudman. Signing off.